How do soccer players stay cool during games, Sarah? I don't know. How do they? They stand near the fans. <laughs> that's, that's a good a, one. That's a knee slapper. That's a good one. We should we should uh, we should tell. I got I got a whole bit a whole list of soccer yeah, jokes we, here. We should do a new one every video and see if people like them. Is, These are dad joke style. Dad jokes are kind of the best though. They're the best. Funnily enough, um, how's it going, everyone? This is our first video back since the She Believes Cup and since the the cup we didn't really watch the Arnold Cup, but a lot of people are pumped about that. So what we are going to do to today, we're going to do as you can see from the title, it's going to be a good old fashioned Sam and Christy video. Yes. <laughs> um, so what we're going to do, we're going to do some Christy video, go over a couple recent things that have been going on. We might not hit every little thing, but the basics, what has been going on, because it's been an exciting, Sam and Christy shippers have had a lot of, have had content recently. So, <laughs> so let's go back. Let's go back to the last video we talked about Sam and Christy. It was right at the point. We remember this picture. Oh, yes, I do. Is that picture a later gram? Uh, is it current, you know? Christy went to She Believes playing in California. Sam had an international break. She did not have any games she was playing. Did right. Sam make the trek to California? We've kind of got an answer, to be honest. We kind of got an answer. Okay. Right after they posted this picture, I think like the day after, Sam posted a picture. And she posted, um, her and Christy, vacation. That oh, was... Oh, my God. So it looked like... Sam officially went to California. At that point, I thought it was to watch the She Believes Cup. As we go on, I don't think she actually made it to She Believes, but we're going to get to that in a second. So <laughs> she went and it looked like she was there in California. And then Christy commented, wish it was a staycation. Ooh. So, which, you know, what we talked about before, if Christy was going to the UK for a weekend, and then Sam, from what, from what I can put together, Sam went... And then was there for like Valentine's Day. And it looks like she left and had to be back in the UK before the She Believes Cup happened on the 17th. So I think she left the day or two before it happened. So she went all the way there and was not able to do she Be see She Believes with Chrissy. Yeah, that's too bad. But at least they could hang out. Yeah. And again, a lot of people are saying, you're going all the way over there for a couple days or three days. Hey, if you can do it, do it's it. It's worth it when Bay is Bay. And traveling is hard, but I will say, I'm sure she gets first class seats. Being on a first class airplane probably is not as hard as being in coach or, <laughs> you know what I mean? So She Believes happen. Christy plays She Believes. Christy played two 90 minute games back to back. I don't think I've ever, she has not done, I don't even think she played a full 90 since she's been back at national team. She played two full 90 minutes back, back to back. So she was, was beautiful. She was working hard. It kind of does suck that Sam wasn't there to support her and IRL, you know what I mean? To be. <laughs> Did you seriously just, I've never heard someone say IRL I say in IRL you don't real think so? life. Christy did end up scoring in the game against Ooh, Iceland. Yeah, she did. In the 87th minute, we kind of talked about it during Iceland, so that was pretty rad. She scored. And actually, even before uh, they played the Iceland game, uh, Christy posted an Instagram, and she posted a picture of her, and it said, Iceland tonight, how fitting, because it was absolutely freezing that night, so cold. Um, there's a picture of her, and then Sam comments, and your shorts will still be jacked up, because we know Christy is very famous, and Rose Lavelle are very famous for jacking up their shorts, um, kind of tucking them in, even like their undies or something. And then... Christy says, wink, wink. So Sam knows what's up. She's, you know, Sam is um, here for it. So <laughs> then I believe it was the day after She Believes ended. Whose birthday was it? Christy's? Yeah. <laughs> it was Christy's birthday. And, you know, like I said last week, Christy had a very good week. She scores a national t on a national team game. Then it's her birthday. Um, Iconic. Yeah, no, that is that's, definitely that's legendary. winning. She's winning that week. Sam did post a birthday message to her. Her birthday. So Sam kind of dropped some some cute freaking pictures of Sam and Christy. So it was her birthday. It said, happy birthday to my love. Sorry your pre-order present doesn't arrive till June, counting down to U-Haul season. So sounds like she got her present. Probably is fancy. Um, and it won't be there till June. So that kind of. Um, I think she's talking about her. She's the present. <gasps> uh, That's how I interpreted okay. it. Okay. Who interpreted that to that? That is so funny. 
I mean, because the best present is yourself, right? That's true. That's true. Okay, so let's go through through some of these pictures. There's Christy and Sam looking fabulous. We saw those pictures from when they went to Miami. Looking amazing. Yeah, she's looking Miami hot. And so that's super cute. Then we have the next picture is Sam and Christy, kind of a reflective situation going on. Okay, the next picture. So a lot of people have been talking about this. I mean, we've kind of talked about it too, that they have matching love rings, those uh looks like Sam is wearing hers on her pointer and then Christy's wearing hers on her middle finger. Um, These love rings are haunting my dreams at this point. Everybody has them. Everyone has And I like them. But like Sarah said in the past, I don't think aesthetically, I don't get it aesthetically. I think they're nice. But you know what I do like about them? No offense to Cartier or whatever. I like they're very unisex. They're not feminine really Mm, and they're not masculine. So I do really like that. You can see that Sam, Sam's is a little bigger, wider. Yeah. And then Christie's is like daintier, like right. smaller. Right. They have different sizes for them. With Okay. And so the next pick is the iconic pick. Classic napping together pick. <laughs> I freaking love that. Looks like they're really in some sleep too. Yeah. I know it does. It does. Beautiful sleepers. <laughs> and yeah. question is, who took the pick? I know, right? Maybe it's when they were visiting Sam, Sam Mewis during uh christmas time then the last picture it's christy with her gucci sweatshirt and um so super cute um and then if you look at the comments down below christy goes oh baby she goes oh baby that was cute and then sam Lewis goes the napping pick heart heart so she was all about oh, that maybe napping she did take that yeah that's yeah. maybe one thing she took that too so that was sam's post to christy and then christy that she got these fire cakes and they were like donuts. I only have a screen cap of it, but um, they were donuts. They were like old oh. fashioned type donuts. I don't think I have the Instagram. I just found the screen cap of it. So it sounds like Chris, Sam had sent Christy those uh, donuts because God, she was. They're always eating so good. I know. And I think Christy has a sweet tooth because she's always showing like sweets oh, and stuff. Yeah. And she, she goes, oh my God, her her at Sam Kerr. So Sam sent her the um, fire cakes, the craft donuts, which I'm sorry, if you don't love a donut. I don't know what's going on. Oh, the other thing I will mention that if you look at the post that Sam Kerr for, did for Christy's birthday, Sam's mom, Roxy Kerr, also wished Christy a happy birthday. So like I said, I love that she gets in right in there and wishes her happy birthday. You know what I mean? Oh, yeah. That's future daughter-in-law, maybe, perhaps. Yeah. I mean, and I love that she isn't shy. Not You know, we love moms and their social media use. Yes. <laughs> I know. It's so cute. Especially, I'd be like, Mom, don't embarrass me. So, where are we now? WSL is back. It is back. They had a game over the weekend. Um, And it seems like Sam Kerr's in a pretty good mood, too, because Sam actually scored two goals against Leicester City. She scored in the 60th minute and 82nd minute. So, she's pretty feeling pretty good. So, where does this leave Christy? So, Christy, as we know, is on Gotham. She's now living. She's a city girl. Like, she was kind of in the country. (laughs) Uh Uh-huh, right. Now. Lifestyle change. She really is. I mean, Houston obviously is a city, but, I mean, she's in, like, New York, New Jersey, New York. Yeah. She is such a New York girl. I'm telling you. I know. Looks like for Christy's birthday also that her and Steph McCaffrey went out, um, for dinner but first i'm going to show this video on the screen it is christy looking like a mother freaking boss and saying who am i to disagree oh because she says sweet dreams are so that was the song oh, there. about dad when i saw this sarah video. did I, pl- I i couldn't stop playing it it was on repeat i even reposted it as our story it yes was so important it was iconic it changed my life and then sam kerr posts who are you <laughs> i like jane campbell's comment New York has changed. You. Yeah. <laughs> and then there was a couple of videos of Steph McCaffrey, Steph McCaffrey's girlfriend yep. and um, Christy. So we have this photo I th- that she's just walking. I mean, I mean, these are glam. These are glam. glam yes. The glamour has taken over. Yes. We can't even. We can't even. And so let's see. We love it. And Aaron, um, Steph, Steph's girlfriend goes, love being a fashion girl with you. And Christy goes, yep. And then Sam goes, both looking very nice girlies. And yeah, she she, probably, she is probably sad she missed That's it, to be honest. That's dad would say. I know! Oh, looking good, girly. <laughs> Such a dad thing. Exactly. Oh, and then there's a picture. And then Steph McCaffrey had a couple of Insta stories of just, them just eating dinner. It looks like they went to... Um, Korean barbecue? Is that what it is? What uh, I cook it yeah. at the table? Yeah. And they went there enjoying probably for 
Christy's birthday. So Christy is New York girl and Gotham girl. So Christy's living her best life. Sam is living her best life. I mean, realistically, Christy had such a good, you know, good games and it was her birthday. Then Sam also scored, looked good at the game against Leicester City. So they're doing well. What did you guys think? I guess the question is, you know, how they went on the short trips to each other's, you know, where they were playing or where they lived. I mean, is that something you would do for your significant other? Would you spend all that time flying to just be able to see them for a day or two, you know? If you had the money, if the price is right, you know it. (laughs) I think so. I think so. Because that serotonin boost you do with see when you see your love, you know. That's worth more than anything. Maybe that's why they were playing so well. Maybe that's why they were playing so well at the games. Because they got to see each other. I mean, yeah. Yeah. What do you guys think? Questions, comments down below. Uh, We will be back soon. Questions, comments down below. We'll talk to everyone later. Have a great night. Bye. Bye.